In this video I'm going to show you how to create a new map style from scratch with Maputnik. The first thing we need to do is choose a source. So you can use Mapbox Streets if you want to host in the Mapbox ecosystem or Open Map Tiles if you want to self-host. So let's add Open Map Tile source. And the first thing you want to do is to inspect the features that you have available. So here you have the features that are in Open Map Tiles. You have, for example, the water. And you can also look up in the vector tile schema documentation to check out what's in the vector tiles. And a good place to start is first with a background layer. So let's add a background and give it a gray color. And now let's add a layer for the water. That will be a fill layer and we'll call it water and we will give it a bluish color. All right, ah, that's the background. We want to style the water. So here we go. Let's change the opacity to 0 0.7. And the next thing we want are boundaries. So let's add a new layer and this will be a line layer. Let's call it boundary. And we want to use the boundary vector tile layer. Add this as a layer and change the color to a lighter gray, like that. And we want to make that boundary dashed. So we want to add a line dash array with a one pixel dash and a 0 0.5 pixel gap. But actually, let's increase that dash to two. You can also edit it here. So that looks okay. So let's add names for the countries. And to do that, if you go in inspect mode, we see here we have our point features in the place layer and there are countries and also cities in here. So we will add a new layer and it will be a symbol layer this time. It will be from the place vector tile layer and we will call it country. Let's add this layer and say as source we want to use the name property. Here we go. We want to make it smaller. Let's give it a stroke. And we also want to transform that to uppercase. And perhaps change the font to bold. Now, as you zoom in, Paris appears up as well, even though that's not a country. So we need to add a filter and say class equals country. And we will create a new layer for cities. So we call that city. And we also want to filter cities. And this time we don't want the text to be uppercase. We want it to be normal. And also our countries should be 14, cities should be 12. All right, now let's add rivers. So we want to start the layer waterway. Let's call it river. And it will be a line layer. And let's copy the color from water for the rivers. We go to paint, copy the color and move it down below the labels and also below the boundaries. And now we're going to style the roads. And this is a line layer as well. So we go back to the add layer model and choose transportation. Let's say road, let's say motorway. Add this as a layer and let's make this white. 
it does the wrong again, but I can always go back with Control Z. And you have to go back even one more. And let's start the motorway, make it white. Let's give it a, let's make it a bit wider. Let's copy the motorway layer and create a casing. So we'll make this slightly larger and give it a black color. And now we have a casing. But we want to move the cities and countries above these ones so that the roads are below. So we drag and drop them down here. Now let's adjust this color again to black and the hair will also a bit more grayish, like this. And we want to filter the motorway only to be of class motorway actually, so we don't get too many of those class motorway. Here we go. And that's how you create a simple map with Maputnik.